A historic day in Georgia. That's how advocates describe the moment that Governor Deal signed the hidden predator bill into law. Tomorrow, a major portion of that bill will open the doors of justice for victims. That's the day a two-year retroactive window opens for those victims. That means no matter what age you are, even if your statute of limitations are up and you have a preponderance of evidence, you can file a civil suit. And alleged abusers won't be the only ones facing the legal ramifications. At any point that a survivor discovers that their injury, be it PTSD, depression, eating disorder, whatever it is, is linked to their trauma, child sexual abuse, at any point in the future, they can file a civil action against their perpetrator and against any entity that was involved. So say there's a church or a youth serving organization. While experts don't believe hundreds of lawsuits will be filed on the first day, they do say many victims are talking to lawyers and weighing their options. Some of those victims News 3 has learned are right here in our area. I think it's going to mean a lot of things. I think it's going to expose a lot of hidden predators in our communities uh, that people had no idea uh, that had uh, perpetrated child sexual abuse. I think it's going to give survivors a lot of confidence and a lot of courage to come forward and accountability. You know, people want their day in court. They want justice. One in four boys and one in six girls are victims of abuse before they turn 18. If you'd like to learn more about the Hidden Predator Act or services for victims, just log on to our website, WSAV.com, and search Hidden Predator.